but <clears throat> every time I start a video, I say hello, and then I clear my throat, I do apologise, it is gross. But I am going to get my hair cut. I've been trying to grow my hair now for six months ish, and I haven't had it cut for. Uh, six to twelve months I have no idea so I've got whole ends I can't do a thing with it anymore so I'm getting it cut because I, I give up um, and I'll let you know what it looks like So this is my new hair, it's, um, you can't really see it, but it's it's shorter, I've still tried to keep some length because I am trying to grow it, it's just, I've got a few little layers in the bottom of it and let's see it, whether it's a bit more manageable, so that's that. Now we are going to pick up Sydney, who is at, oh, sunshine out. We're going to pick up Sydney from the vets. He's been to the vets this morning. He has to have an annual health check. Oh, oh, oh. So they'll check his ears and his nails and his, they'll do a blood test and what else are they doing? Oh, he'll, he'll get his flea treatment and his worming treatment kennel and cough. kennel cough injection. And um, so he'll be feeling sorry for himself. Uh, I can't hardly see you. There you are. So we're going to go and pick him up now, and then, and then we'll finally go home. Right, I'm going to put you on driver view so you can see how gorgeous the views are. up Sydney. Sid! <laughs> Not even looking this way. Um, from the vets and we have to go back next week because they may have found a heart murmur. 
they're hoping it's not. They're hoping he was just uh, very excited about being at the vets and having lots of treatment done, but they want to check when we're around him so he's a bit calmer just to see whether he, he does have a heart murmur or not. They told us not to worry about it, but you know, he's our baby, so we're going to worry. <sighs> Um, that's about it really so I'll let you know I'll give you a bit of an update next week about that Drive safely for Christ's sake. Right, so tomorrow is our baby grandson, our youngest grandson's second birthday party. He was two on the ninth. Uh, yeah, where, what day was, was that? Wednesday. Yes. Wednesday. On Wednesday, and so we're driving to Manchester tomorrow to go to a two-year-old birthday party so you will be coming along I've had permission to film the boys and publish it on YouTube I've had permission from their mum haven't technically had permission from the dad, dad so I'll I'll, um, I'll ask him first because you know it's only polite isn't it if you don't want your children to be on YouTube then you you know you have to respect that <clears throat> but we'll see hopefully you'll get to see the boys tomorrow um it's gonna take us a couple of hours to get down to manchester from here so it's a long drive so there may be a montage or two but it depends how much footage i've got from the party because there's going to be guests there that obviously won't want to be filmed so I have to pick and choose when I whip the camera out, if you, if you understand. So, anyway, keep your fingers crossed for Sydney. Let's hope it's nothing and he was just an excited bundle of joy. That wheeze everywhere. That wheeze everywhere. <laughs> it's like he'd, he'd not seen us for a month and he just weed all over the floor. But anyway. I hope he's okay. But I don't think it, it heart murmurs you can treat, can't you? Yeah. It's not like it's like a day, you know, is imminently gonna collapse or anything. Right. right. So anyway, okay. I will speak to you tomorrow. Bye bye.